Good morning, good evening, and good night. So Nintendo released the Nintendo Direct at the time of writing this video two days ago. Now this Direct had some very hype things. However it'll cover things I enjoy in the Direct in another video. Something else they put in this Direct was well, Wave 5 of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe's Booster Course Pass. Now at first I surprisingly wasn't that hyped. Now there were some leaks of a new 2D Mario which was something I was very hyped for. But then we actually get to the teaser for Wave 5. Now I was waiting the whole Direct going okay the next one will be Wave 5. And then it happened. Rev up for Wave 5! So when I saw this track, I was very excited. Not only did I predict this course correctly for Wave 5, but it also looks very good. So then I stumbled upon the name, Squeaky Clean Sprint. Now it is not a bad name, in my opinion it's pretty good. However I just keep forgetting it. However, now sure we'll have to wait a bit but yeah that's already one thing. Now this was looking amazing. Sponges, a hula hoop, a rubber duck, the fan, toilet. What really caught my attention was the two starting lines. There's probably going to be two paths just like in 3D's Bowser Castle which is cool. And I've literally only talked about what, 7 seconds of this right now. So then I was waiting for characters, and then, it happened, Petey. Now Petey was a pretty obvious pick for characters. There's a tour Nitro based after him meaning PPC is probably going to be in Wave 5. He was scrapped in Wii, and this is the first time, has been playable in a console Mario Kart 4. 20 years, yes, 20. But nothing at all surprised me more than what we got next. Now I was really excited before this, but after this, I got even more excited, and it caught me so off guard. From Mario Kart 7, Wiggler. Wiggler, now has been Dataman for tour. And to be honest, he was literally one of the last characters I expected, but I'm glad has here. He has an angry animation when he gets hit which is very cool. But he caught me so off guard in the trailer my jaw dropped. And then after we finally for the first time get to play as Comic. Or as the trailer says. And from Mario Kart Tour, Comic. Now has probably gonna be my main. Sorry Dry Bones. Has a small weight, and he has very cool animations. Like he literally turns invisible in one of his tricks. And the fact that there's three characters is amazing, and I didn't point this out. But the music in this course is pretty cool. I probably won't always listen to it but it's cool. This track looks very good especially for a bathroom. Like out of every single thing. They managed to make a bathroom. Yes where you shower. Wash your hands and go to the toilet fun and look amazing. Now what I'm going to do is predict SCS route. Now last time I predicted Yoshi's Island route. I was extremely accurate. And hopefully this happens again. Now if you go on the Mario wiki. You'll see there is like 9 screenshots. So let's figure out the route. Now in this scene we can see Mario gliding and the finish line is here. And in this image right at the end there is a ramp. So if we go near the end of the trailer. We can see Comet tricking off of this ramp here to a mushroom in the top. Now here we can also see Petey going in the top. Now after I predict is the drain because in this scene. We can see this structure of a drain. And so is it in the bathtub. Then after that I think we'll go to this half pipe mainly because when Petey is driving in the drain. It starts becoming brighter meaning he probably left it. Then I predict we go next to the toilet and glide over it because we can see this fan here. Then I think there's just a couple turns and that's it. Overall it's a simple route but I'm pretty sure it'll be a course I will enjoy. Now this video was pretty short, and although I don't know my next one, I do know I have a Discord server you can join. Guys please do anyways that was the whole video. So goodbye pinballers and go play Mario Kart.